Hey, how's it going, everyone? Welcome back to another review of Business Proposal. You know, I look like I belong in the drama. But anyway, episode 8 was so much fun to watch. Sungun and Yongso never fail to entertain me. It was fun seeing both couples just go through whatever they go through in your, you know, typical rom-com drama. I think in this episode, Taemu now understands how Sungun felt when Yongso told him, hey, let's pretend it didn't happen. I mean, Hadi told him it was a mistake. Pretty much the same situation, in my opinion. So first, let's start with Taemu and Hadi. They kissed. We know. They like each other. We know. But then Hadi says it was a mistake. It didn't matter what Taemu did for her. She just kept on rejecting him. The expensive meals, the carnival. Shoot, if I was in Hadi's position, I would have been swayed just like that. Like I said in the beginning of the episode, Taemu now understands what Songun went through, you know, when the person you like tells you, hey, let's pretend it didn't happen. Hey, it was a mistake. Again, same thing. And I kind of find it funny that Hadi was trying to come up with an excuse on why they kiss. She says, we were close together. Well, when you like each other and you're close together, you're going to kiss. Duh. And I like how Temu told her, well, it was your fault. He's right. I mean, she was the one that said, why do you make me think about you? That's the ultimate, hey, I like you. But then, of course, Minu had to be the one to accuse Temu for toying with Hadi. Of course, you know, he's going to be that jealous type. And he comes in, accuses Temu, and punches him. And that's the number one thing you don't want to do when you're a side character. Punch the main lead. Because if you do, that's going to get the main girl to get closer to the main guy. And then towards the ending of the episode, Hadi calls Temu and tells him, how are you going to make me fall for you and you're going on a blind date? He doesn't go on the blind date. They meet up. They kiss. They're a couple. Yes, a couple. No mistakes, Hadi. No mistakes. For Songun and Yongso, the only thing I want to talk about is Yongso's cooking. <laughs> so at first, it was really cute of her to cook a meal for him. Man, I'm so jealous of him. Young Seo is such a beautiful, beautiful woman. But anyway, she cooked for him and she wanted him to be brutally honest. I mean, just like she said, no one can improve unless someone tells the truth. Well, that's not exactly what she said, but it's along those lines. And what came out of his mouth, <laughs> she didn't really expect that. There's still sand in the clams. The veggies were overcooked. The pork tastes fishy. It wasn't defrosted properly. I just love these two, man. They're just so adorable together. I do believe they have good chemistry. And again, I would love to see these two in a different drama. You know, I feel like they can offer more as actors. And yeah, that's pretty much it. There's really nothing else I can talk about. Um, I just enjoyed watching both couples just go through what couples go through. Confusion, telling the truth, realizing your feelings for each other, kissing in a very beautiful lit location. Yeah, pretty much. So anyway... If there's anything I might have missed, please leave it in the comments below. Other than that, if you like this video, leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe. See ya.